Hi, this is Mike Callahan, Dr. FileFinder, and welcome to your Butter Session Time tutorial on what is a root kit. You may have heard the term in relation to viruses and trojans and worms, oh my, but a root kit gets its name from root, which refers to the super user in Linux systems, and kit, which refers to a kit of utilities to control the system. Ironically, even though root primarily used in Linux systems, most root kits affect Windows computers. A root kit can be a legitimate program. What it is, in brief, is a program that buries itself, hides itself in the operating system so that it's undetectable. The person in control of the root kit can control your computer. It basically hides so that you cannot find it in Windows Explorer, you can't find it in Task Manager, you can't see it, but it's there and it can take over your computer. Many antivirus programs now have the capability of removing root kits and detecting them as well. So a root kit can be used to monitor employees or children and so on, but primarily when you hear about it, a root kit is a piece of malware that tries to take over your computer. And that's all there is to it. Hey, this is Doc. If you're looking for a cheap and easy way to put your own content on the web, go get domain names from Hover.com. Just visit Hover.com slash Butterscotch and you'll get 10% off and support shows like these. Thanks.